Hey, what's up guys? It's Langer and it's time for another account overview. It's been a little over three months since the last one. I wanted to do an account overview on the five year anniversary of the account to Wow Langer or to Woo Langer, depending on how you say it. Uh, but this is my biggest free to play account. And sadly on the fifth year uh, anniversary, I did not get what I wanted to get for this overview so it took me an extra month to get it and guys you'll see what i got um what i was waiting for so since the last overview guys you see my uh my mix set i got some upgrades uh since last time i got one astrolite extra on the winter mitts i got the firewall plate to mythic and i put two astrolite on it and what's the next thing What's the next thing, guys? There we go. The Dragon's Talent is finally, finally gold. Uh, how did I get that? I got this special drop, guys. I got this today uh, from six Black Wing Chests. So if you have been following my channel or my streams, uh, you probably know that what I've been doing lately is I've been looking for L events when there are um black wing chess and there was a um watcher research which i don't need watchers anymore i got 69 extra metal wow as if i planned that i did not plan that i did not know that <laughs> but i got <laughs> oh my god that's nice i got six black wing chess and it gave me one blue i was just missing six grays but i got one blue one blue is the equivalent of 16 grays so i'll Basically, once I do the upgrade, you'll see I have enough for um, 10 extra, uh, 10 extra, whoa, 10 extra metals, uh, not metals, <laughs> rares. All right, let's do this upgrade, guys. Uh, I will definitely uh, push this. There we go. I should also, if you guys don't know, you should always equip your uh, course helm when you do that. Uh, not upgrade, just equip it so that you get the there you go so that you get the forging bonus of 15 percent so every speed up counts when you're free to play let's upgrade this three days i don't recall what was the time but basically let's go and i'll wait the two seconds guys because i'm free to play let's go this is it uh the dragon stalin are now gold i have seven out of eight pieces at least gold uh on this account pretty pretty good another upgrade i think i got one more jewel so basically the last jewel that i want to change would be this one here uh the gargantua jewel i'm just waiting to get a i think i'm missing like one blue and one green uh cap jewel to replace this so this is my set now guys uh since the last time like i said a very nice upgrade uh what i'm gonna do um yeah i think i put my anti-scout on for this uh, I don't want to get, <laughs> because there's some people with the butts, the shield butt in this kingdom. Uh, is there, is there, is there, is there, there you go. I will, uh, this guy, I will, I will go in fury for this guy, let's go, there we go. Might get some spies, uh, let's look at my uh, stats. With Fury on, I, we currently have one fort, but it's HP, so it does not really matter. Uh, Cav HP, but if we look at the stats in Fury, uh, I get a decent amount, decent amount. I get basically 622, 590, and 550. So basically the average is around 590. I think I gain about 15% on average. Uh, the rest of the stats, defense, we don't really care, but it's between 300 and 400 uh, percent. 350 on the HP. Uh, counters is now uh, 25, 40, and 6. So I definitely need to work on the Cav uh, infantry counter from the research. Uh, I think the last one here would be uh, also the why it's low is because of Jade Worm is very low. Uh, and then the army uh, stats, three, uh, 233, uh, 489. Uh, and then basically the debuffs are maxed out. And I think uh, I got a decent amount with the familiars where I get about 4%. There we go. 4% on all the stats. So this is basically the upgrade for the mix set. Uh, like I said, I showed the, the stats in Fury, uh, which I don't, I think I did it from Trial by Fire last time. Uh, speaking of Trial by Fire, uh, I've been like the last stage, I've been maxed for a long time now. Working on mix stage, I've gotten 700 
extra stages since last time. Currently, I'm stuck. I need some cav upgrades. Yeah, I need I need about yeah I need some upgrades to get about six thousand uh, more units uh, on this one. It's a bad stage. Uh, it's one of those stage where you have a ton of uh, range units. So, you, but it's it's a it's a in front line. So I gotta get rid of the inf, uh, and this is what I'm sending. Um, all right. Uh, let's look at the heroes, guys. Uh, there's really no change on the heroes. I just want to show you that I got gold, Boommeister, gold, Chaos Dragon, completely free to play. Speaking of free to play, I forgot to show it. So, five minutes in the video. There you go. First purchase bonus. If you don't know my accounts, they're all free to play except my main. My main, I really, I think I showed it once because it's on my phone. So it's a, um, it's kind of a. Uh, it's a hassle just to record stuff from my phone uh, but yeah all my accounts otherwise are free to play watcher is maxed out it's been maxed for a while now about three years it took me about two years to get this uh, and i got chaos dragon uh at the four and a half year mark the rest of the normal heroes are gold uh the trophies are all uh there as far as the newer ones, well, obviously Flower Maiden is now a green. I think almost everyone should have a Flower Maiden at green unless you've taken something else from gu a Guild Expedition. I have kind of stopped doing those limited challenges. I've said in the last video that I would not mind uh, just getting some medals for uh, troop training from uh, Dark Follower as well as Witch Doll, but I really don't care about the rest. Uh, the I'm never gonna get them to gold regardless even with the new method speaking of the new method uh, for some reason I did not try but I got three medals I don't know which one I'm gonna take uh, maybe I'm gonna wait I'm gonna get some more maybe in the future we'll see the new paragon is not something that we get medals from all right let's go look at familiars all right, for familiars, uh, one thing that I want to show, uh, <laughs> I have done pack four for a long time now. I don't really need pack four, but one thing that I like to do is stack them up. I've gotten 2,600 pack four since last time. We'll see how many I can get. Can I get 69,000? We'll see. <laughs> but uh, yeah, all, the, um, all the, the familiars are maxed out as well as the skills, all the skills, the normal ones. Uh, until we get to pack five and I want to show you what happened with my pack five since last time I got black wing to elder stage I could get it to level 60 but I'm just waiting for extravaganza these are easy quest 20 points so th and there's no rush there's no rush <laughs> dragon tiger uh, doesn't know that I'm recording in fury <laughs> there we go um, now, uh, there's no rush for me. The skills, I could get like an extra 1.5% army attack as well as 2% army HP in Battle Fury. Hellfire really doesn't matter. I'm not a rally lead, so it does not matter. But what I've done, so I've gotten 61 runes. I think we got uh, very lucky with a bargain store. Um, and then I got the army talent up to level 7. So I don't know how many orbs it basically I got. Probably around 700 since last. Does that make sense? I don't know. No, 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 not 700. Sorry, I will be missing around 700 to max this. So I don't. Maybe I got like 300 orbs. Yeah, in three months, probably like 200 or 300 orbs. Uh, not as much. Uh, as far as the other uh, familiars, basically, um, UE Ops says is 114. I got 17 extra runes. I got 14 on Queen B. I got 18 on Bon Appetit. From this one, I got 13. Uh, on the last video, I upgraded this one to, um, what's the, adult? Yeah, adult stage. And I got this. Uh, next one would be Gargantua, I think. Yes, I got 15 runes and then I got 13 from Frostwing. Frostwing would be the closest one uh, for an upgrade, but I'm I'm not gonna do the army talents on these. Uh, the next one I might do uh, will be Queen Bee, because Queen Bee is range. Yes, but <laughs> I don't know when. <laughs> now, another thing that I've been working on uh, is the Red Orb, so Mole Shaman. I've gotten three army level, three army talents since last time. Uh, very close to getting level 9. Once I'm done with this one, I will move on to Nosferos. Doing this with Nosferos will help me on Trial by Fire, especially this current stage that I'm I'm 
uh, working on because uh, I uh, I need to improve my calf, which will help. But I think I need to get at least level three or four uh, for this to be worth it. Uh, so yeah, so that's the plan. But uh, like I said, I need uh, I need around like 200 orbs to get to finish uh, Mole Shaman. Uh, next up, I want to show my artifact. <laughs> Is that uh, okay? That's my dragon style. So far, no one has spies me. <laughs> All right, I'll just put that so that they know that I'm online. There you go. Um, all right, artifacts that I want to show. Uh, I <laughs> one thing that I used to track in the past was the unobtained artifact. It doesn't make any sense. Last time we had, we were at 23. And now I'm at 37 <laughs> because they've added a bunch. So unobtained artifact doesn't mean anything but i got seven new ones uh since the last time i got also all the antique ones i've gotten um uh, what else what else what else i also got an extra 330 openings yeah 330 openings um another thing i want to show uh is so we're gonna go to my profile because i want to show my um I want to show uh, the stars on the castle skin. So I got 18 stars on the castle skin, has not changed. Uh, artifacts, I've gotten 26 extra stars and 39 levels. This is starting to be like slower and slower. Even though we get some new artifacts where you can get easy levels and stars, it's um, yeah, it's not it's not easy. Uh, it's not it's not as easy as when you we started. Uh, as far as the goals, I think I'm going to wait for the end of the video. I'm going to show you my goals that I have for this uh, because I moved from unobtained to uh, basically my artifact collection as far as goals in the future. Uh, even though I got all of this, I'm still uh, I still got a ton of materials in my bags. Uh, as you can see, records, good amount for Gilfest as well as brushes. So there's potential uh, to upgrade. Um, next up, I want to show you guys, well, there is nothing new. Basically, I've completed Vergeway. Uh, all my cards are maxed. Uh, it's been for, it's been like that for a while. I don't open these things anymore. I don't think that, that IGG will release new ones, but basically I would just get uh, duplicates if I were to do that. Uh, I don't think they're going to ever release uh, something else on Vergeway new chapter. I know that there's I think I could get to chapter 12 I think but it's only rewards and I don't really care about these There you go um, All right, let's move on to my set so I've showed you my mix set. Let's go look at, at my Various sets. So I got my unthink set uh, since last time I got one upgrade on the off end the rest is basically the same. I'm still rocking this thing from, I think it was Sansea that I got this. And the thing is, uh, with even without this, it still gives you like monster uh, boost damage and max energy. I think it gives you 1% and 1000. In the future, I might work on the normal boots, but I still think it's worth keeping this and then upgrading the rest in the meantime. Uh, like I said, one upgrade on this. Uh, I've showed, no, I've not shown my familiar. Familiar has not changed. I'm very close to bone staff to purple, uh, which is the next I want to upgrade. I don't want to ever touch to this anymore, uh, just because it only provides skill stones, speed, as well as uh, experience boost, which I don't need because I, I'm not going to have any gems anymore. I'm going to use elixirs and potions for the pack five. So there's no use for me on that. So this is why I'm, I'm just saving for the bone staff. Uh, next up, next up, next up, next up, my gather set. This is what I use. I think I got one upgrade on the accessory. I'm still using this, the sacred boots uh, for the speed and the capacity. But once I will get this, the purple, the speed's going to be a little bit better. And I really don't care about the capacity at, at this point. Uh, I don't care if I get hit on tiles. Um, but aside from that, no upgrades. Uh, we've looked at my mix. My rain set looks like this. I got two upgrades basically. Well, no, three because I got uh, the one astral line. I got this to mythic plus two, and, and I just got this to gold. So this is the big upgrade. Uh, I'm in mixed talents right now, but with uh, range attack gives me this. 
If I were to go blast, I would be very close to 700% on my range blast, which is my specialty on this account. Let's go quickly on the last sets. T5, I've gotten five upgrades. I got some very lucky drops. I think I got this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. Um, so that was pretty good. I'm getting a decent amount of crafting speed with this. Uh, as far as speed set, basically uh, the accessory was upgraded, but uh, right now I'm saving my brains for this. Um, I think I could upgrade this, yes, but I'm saving for this, which is still very far. We're talking about 3 out of 10. All right, uh, do I have any others? Uh, I got a troop uh, troop training, which I use this. Like I said, the next upgrade is probably going to be this, I think. Yeah, I'm going to save my Blazing Amber. Uh, and then this is maxed. I don't think I'm ever going to get this to gold on this account. Why do I have Monster Hunt gear? Uh, so that uh, when I train troop, I can get, I can keep my energy eye if there's an opportunity for a level 3 monsters or something like that for L event. All right, going quickly on Sigil. Uh, Sigil, I'm very close to a second purple, but I'm not gonna uh, unlock a second uh, research just yet, maybe in the future. Uh, I'm only gonna, at this, at this point, I'm only I'm gonna upgrade if I get my purple to go, so I need three purple. <laughs> and um, lastly, also, I wanna show my Blazing Embers. Blazing Embers, I got seven, but last time I had 13, but I used 12. So basically I got six extra since last time, pretty good. Uh, I need seven, I think, for my next upgrade, which is going to be Skull Crusher. All right, let's move on to Troop Comp. All right, as far as my Troop Comp, uh, basically I got uh, 1.5 extra million troops since last time, I got 35.8. Uh, basically, T1s, I got a couple hundred thousand T1s, I think, since last time. I did not pay attention, but my T2 has grown by 300,000 each. So, very getting very close to 7 million on each uh, T2. Uh, no change on tier 3. T4, um, it's about the same. So, I lost a little bit of range units. I gained a little bit of uh, cav units. Do I have? I think I have troops in the infirmary. I do. So I got 21,000. Uh, basically, we got <laughs> we got capped uh, on a um, on a we got capped. I, th I think this this was from KVK or something like that. Um, but yes, yeah, so I got 21,000 and I lost a bunch of range. I need to uh, retrain them during the next extravaganza. And um, my T5, uh, basically, I get about 60,000 of each. Uh, this is not the real number because once I heal 200,000, uh, I'm going to be at 500. So basically, the half million mark of T5 has been reached on this account, on this free-to-play account. How much will it cost me to heal those 200 million, 200,000? Oh, 8 million Lunite. Oh, so I'm going to try. <laughs> I'm not going to try. I'm going to wait for Guild Expedition to uh, heal, obviously. this is So that means basically... 4 million. I'm gonna save a little bit uh, by doing this and uh, I'm gonna try as much as I can to uh, just get my um, passive Lunite uh, production as much as I can. But then at the end of Guild Expedition, I will definitely heal everything. Um, what else? What else? What else? Uh, let's go look at my bags. Um, let's go look at my bags. So I talked about... Uh, I talked about last time. So, by the way, guys, you know, if you know, you can sell this. Uh, I got 33,000. So, whenever I uh, train troops and I'm low on gold, what I do is I go here. I go to this. And basically, you can sell this. So, just from this, I got a million. It's not a lot, but every bit's every bit helps so there you go i don't need to open these right now um but what i wanted to show on the unique side so there's i'm gonna i'm gonna go you can like slow down the video i use my random number locators uh mostly during guild bash so i will donate some for easy points uh this is what i have don't ask me to give you this uh, these guys if you don't know you cannot gift your bags uh and i'm free to play okay so please please don't go in my messages asking me to give you this 
these. I've opened all my uh, admin and guild scrolls lately during extravaganza and after. Uh, pretty good. Uh, as far as the rest, energy is decent. I think last time I did not have a lot. Uh, migration scrolls, there you go. Um, the other thing, I gained about 100 star, star scrolls since last time. I did not get any uh, extra castle stars. We're not gonna count the anima uh, archaic tome. We're gonna look at the uh, research later. Uh, Lunite, I am... I'm down 10 million since last time. I was at 80 million. I'm down to 70 million. Uh, those, uh, those suicide, <laughs> those very bad hits that we did uh, during KVK uh, are very expensive. So I need to be careful with the rally lead. We got some trigger happy rally lead that will do uh, that. They don't really care how much money they spend on the game so uh so with these you got to be careful and i have to be careful because basically we're talking about eight million it's going to be down to four million with guild expedition but as a free-to-play player i have to manage my lunite still i got a decent amount to play with uh if i get down too low i'm just gonna stop joining those bad rallies that sometimes our uh, trigger happy rally lead will will launch and just focus on the easy one or the necessary one just like wow all right the other thing i want to show in my uh in my bags let's go to speed up i think i got a decent amount of normal speed up yes i do uh, i could definitely boost troops if i wanted to uh by a huge amount i got a ton of uh winged boots uh research is very low I used a ton of uh, research speed up on extravaganza, so that, that's why I did not really boost my troops. Uh, I could use some uh, wall repair if I wanted to, but I prefer to grow my accounts. I got a ton of uh, healing speed up also. Uh, and there's still a ton of merging speed up that I can use for... Uh, well, I used to save those for Blackwing. Now I can save them for special events. And I got crafting speed up, which I don't really care. I'm not going to use my Luna, Lunite to basically boost up my tier 5 count or my craft, my luminous gear. So I'm not going to do that. Uh, let's go look at another thing in my combat. I got a ton of shields, obviously, from Monster Hunt, uh, generally, in all the events. Anti-Scout, uh, as far as the big... Uh, I got... 22 50 percent attack boost so this one is good uh there's really nothing on their chest that's worth talking about uh i've opened a ton on stream lately so i'm very very low uh if we look at my uh food and my resource bag food has been going i buy a lot and one reason for that is the monster hunt bus that i've been doing uh they've been re really successful and i've been doing a decent amount uh, the other one would be Guild Expedition. <laughs> so some people say, well, I'm, uh, Guild Expedition is ruining me. Well, for me, I don't, I, I don't play, I don't, let's just say that I play smart. Okay, guys, I play smart, I get my rewards, and, and those rewards include a ton of uh, war prep chests. So this went up, uh, stone has actually gone down, so I'm guessing that uh cav rallies or range rallies and not inf so i guess we did not uh we we i had to use a ton of stone uh, because of those rallies timber has been going up so i guess once again probably a ton of cav uh, cav units that we uh we sent so that's why i did not use a ton of timber and uh or has been i think yeah i gained 1.2 billion food 1.2 billion wood and 1 billion or uh, about 500 million gold so this is what i have been um those are the change in my bags next up let's go look at research all right as far as research is concerned um since last time economy no change it was it was completed defense also was completed last time i did gain a ton of research under military uh this is what i'm working on right now i'm trying to finish my uh counters i've gotten seven research no nine nine new research on this tree uh i got enough tomes to finish this and that's about it yeah so basically i'm missing i think i'm missing so that's 400 that's 468 for this one, and 
This one is 300, so this is probably um, 350, I guess, or 400. So I think I'm missing like 800 tomes for the last two levels. So I got, I got enough to finish this one, obviously, because it's running, and this one. So I'm gonna be at eight out of 10. This one would be completed. Uh, so this is what I've gotten. Monster Hunt was completed a long time ago, so no change. Up defense, I got one extra research. I don't recall which one. I use those research for uh, to complete L event. So uh, basically, eight, nine is what I got on this. Uh, these give me 500,000 might, so I don't really want to uh, do these, but at some point I will do them just because I'm a kind of a completionist as far as I'm concerned. I'm gonna run out of tomes. I'm gonna need to do some norm normal research, tomeless research. So I'll finish these, but I will not prioritize upgrade defense. I will do familiars. We're gonna look at familiars after that. Uh, up military, I finally completed that. Uh, so I was missing those three research. So I got max army size with, uh, well, army limit now up to eight. Um, leadership was completed last time, also already. Military comments, same, was already completed. Uh, familiar, uh, I got eight new research. I'm getting, uh, once again, uh, kind of close to tomeless research, completely done. I think most of the research were done on the merging cost. Um, I don't need skill experience boost. Skill stone merging is kind of fine, but durable ward is very useless. This is kind of useless, my guys. I do this because I am not that big. Uh, migration scroll cost maybe one. I've always cost one on this account. Uh, now I'm getting to the point that where it might cost me two uh, two scrolls, but uh, uh, this is useful for uh, events. So that's what I've done lately. Uh, familiar battle. I was missing five five research for battle slot four. This was completed, so like as I said last time, I wanted to complete Battle Slot 4 and uh, basically start uh, counters. I will be going back and um, make some progress on Familiar Battle after counters, so sometime in the next two, three months. Uh, the rest has no change, so sigils, as always, well, always, ever since I did my first overview two years ago, I had Elmet Sigil unlocked. I will maybe in the future go down the Legs Sigil uh, because I think that these are better than these because Siege. Um, but uh, yeah, at the moment I have no plan to upgrade any of this. Uh, nothing on Wonder Battles. I have nothing on Gears. Well, I mean, I got T5, but I got no new research done. And Advance Wonder Battle is also uh, blank. I've not done anything on Advance Wonder Battle. All right, let's let's wrap this up with my future goals. So if you have been following, you guys know that I have, I have specific goals on each account. This account has more than one goal. So the first goal that I've said, and it's been a long time, I said I wanted to get this full mythic. So it is realistic. Um, I've already gotten two of these. This one is halfway done. Uh, I'm missing basically five uh, brains. Probably gonna get this by the end of the year at with the amount of uh, monstrous crate that we're getting. This one I mi I'm missing six. Yeah, close to six. Maybe I'm gonna get it by the end of the year. So um, once again, I will need though the uh, the blazing embers. Uh, I don't have enough right now, but by the time I get the rares, I should definitely be able to get at least one of those. Uh, this one is going to be very hard. I'm getting about two gold per year, so it could take me up to four years to finish this. We'll see. It's rough. It's rough, guys. Um, this is also going to be very rough, the, the cups. Uh, getting two cups to Mythic is going to be rough. I'm already at five out of... 13, so I got I got four, four ALOs in the last three months. That's pretty good. So basically, at this pace, I'm getting around what 14 a years. So I should get this done to gold by the end of the year. So I should have by the end of the year maybe this, these to mythic, two gold, and then this one. This one should be at one. Yes. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna get this by the end of the year. I think it's a little bit harder. 
we'll see baby sometime next year but basically the goal is to get this the full mythic uh i would say that worst case scenario is gonna take me four years it could be as uh i'm thinking about three years at this point so it would put the lifetime of the account at eight years uh the next as i said i want to uh finish full counters uh which is this uh, which i'm very close matter of weeks now uh, I want to also I want to go down the battle slot five uh, battle slot five might be achieved sometime next year in 2025 I don't know it depends on how many tomes I get it's it's a it's a huge amount of tomes uh, I think it's like 15,000 it's an extra 15,000 so uh, I've already spent a ton I've already spent close to 40,000 I think I'm not sure I at least 35 I think maybe 30 let's say 30 I would need an extra 15,000 I've not counted guys but uh, you guys can also do the math uh, I said I saw that I wanted to get my black wing maxed uh, the level is not really an issue I could get it today if I wanted to uh, for uh, for 16 if I yes 50 yes definitely <laughs> so the level is not an, an issue uh, it's the uh, the yellow orb so I'm missing 100 for level 8 I think it's about uh, another 7 700 to get uh, if, yeah, maybe not so if it's 188 I think it's 280, 280 something for for level nine and then maybe 400 yeah it's a, I'm missing about 800 total I think I'm about I'm about halfway um, sometime sometime next year also this is gonna be maxed out um, and then also guys I said I would talk about the artifacts so <laughs> there we go um, this one's gonna be a little bit funny okay so 287 and 649 so what is my future goal for this uh, you know what guys you see the big big accounts they got like 600 500 700 stars well with the amount of artifact that they're adding i want to get to 500 it's gonna be it's gonna take a long time but i want to get to 500 stars <laughs> i know that 400 is probably gonna take probably gonna get to 400 by the end of the year but i want to get to to 500 at some point in the future and as far as levels when you look at the big big accounts they they got like a thousand uh, 1,100, 1,200. So in the future, I want to get to 1,069. 1,069 levels is my future goal. Uh, that's assuming that they're going to release a ton more artifacts. And it's assuming that I'm going to keep on playing. <laughs> All right, guys. That is about it for this account overview. Like I said, I am now 7 out of 8. Uh, at least gold on my mix set. Um... In the next three months, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to get an upgrade except for one jewel. So this is not where I'm going to get some progress done. We'll see. Maybe I'm going to find something uh, worth talking about in the next three months for the next account overview. If you like this stuff, hit the like button. Subscribe. We're very close to 5,000 subscribers, guys. Uh, if you have a nice free-to-play account, uh, feel free to shout it out. I also uh, want to do some account overview of other players. Uh, on my uh, streams from time to time so uh, join up and contact me on discord if you want to do this all right guys enough rambling thanks for watching and i'll see you later